All right, it's Eric Larice of Team Rev DD. It's my uh, teammate Chris Guzman in his uh, 240 hatch with a uh, SR20 motor. So uh, what can you tell us about this car, Chris? What, what, what have we done so far to the car? <laughs> well, this used to be a Formula D car and uh, I pretty much made it as stock as possible. I have a factory tuned SR20 DT right at 205 horsepower. Uh, the suspension has, everything's adjustable on it. It's extra rigid. I have a half of a roll cage in here. Um, a lot of extra support. Um, roll cage. And of course, a lot of extra goodies that are from Japan, like my, my some cosmetics and the uh, Japanese body kit. Nothing too special. It's all used, but uh, you know what? It's this thing can really turn like. Can you a, go up? We can make a left over there. Okay. Let's go straight. Yeah. Okay. Well, this thing is actually handles just like a uh, Mini Cooper as far as uh, turning radius. Never used to do that before stock mode. Thanks to the uh, adjustable stuff that they use for drifting. I think they're TN, I guess, extension rods. And other right. than that, it's all factory. There's a cop over there. Yeah. So why do you want to go over there? Oh, it's pretty fast. There's a cop right here. Yeah, I know. <laughs> well, we're not going to go fast over there. Okay. But go left or right? I can go left, and then we just... Well, turn around. Yeah, I could do a turn around. Maybe he's not here anymore. Yeah. I don't want a chance to just go fast a little. Are you still recording? Yeah. Of course, it's all factory TV, nothing extra modified. The only thing it's really modified is the cooling, the radiator. Uh, it's just an extra big radiator. <laughs> and that's about it. <clears throat> Synthetic oil. Nothing too you can turn around over here. You just watch out for what that car. What else we got here? Oh, wow, you have a nice construction right here. Yeah. So what are going to be your uh, next mods to have? Uh, make it AC. <laughs> AC, there you go. Oh, and uh, I need to... Are you good? No cops? Yeah. <laughs> you good? I'm going to do the uh, synthetic oil in the tranny and uh, also do the HKS uh, actuator on the right next to the turbo. Give it another one or two extra boosts. Um, nothing too special, but uh, it, it's it's already a pretty good motor. It's strong as it is, as you can feel it. Absolutely. It's, and it's stock. When we when I pop the hood, you're gonna be like, what? It looks just like my car. It's like factory. <laughs> Parts are direct from Japan. And uh, it's steering wheel too. Is that from Japan too? I know it just says Silvio on there. Yes, it's off the K Silvio. K Sylvia. Yeah, it's like an 80s, 90s version. And what happened, it was really weird, is that the uh, 240SX in Japan is called the 180SX. And towards the end of the 180SX, they came out with the S15 motors in them because everybody wanted the S15 motor in them. And so Nissan went ahead and put them in there, but they were still called the 180SX, even though they were a 2.0 liter. Right. And then you have, so what they ended up doing is making this into a Type X style. Uh, hatchback where it has a rear tail light and like a skyline um, but it looks really neat it's real simple clean a lot of it's fiberglass all the ground effects fiberglass the hood's fiberglass the front nose is of course fiberglass definitely helps the car to go faster then for sure right? oh yeah it's uh it's a little different i mean you have to use the shaking and you have to rigid it up a little bit but i, mean, I guess make it stiff but other than right. that it just feels really good Are they going to go right or? Are they going to go left? It's pretty fast. Hi right, guys, this has been an interview Team F3D of my friend's Sylvia 240 hatchback. Peace. Keep it rev.